Is Hasselblad finally ready to bridge the gap between pure still photography and modern hybrid shooting? That's the question many professionals will be asking when the rumored Hasselblad X2D2 makes its debut. With leaks revealing a 100 megapixel medium format sensor, DJI powered LiDAR autofocus, and possibly even the first real hint at video capabilities from Hasselblad, the X2D2 seems poised to challenge the status quo in high-end imaging. But will it be enough to sway photographers who have been tempted by more versatile competitors like Fujifilm's GXF lineup? While Hasselblad has not officially revealed the X2D2's full design, the details emerging from certification filings and leaked images suggest an approach rooted in refinement rather than reinvention. The body will retain the clean, minimalist aesthetic the X system is known for, with a premium build that blends practicality with elegance. Subtle but significant changes are expected, such as the addition of a joystick on the back for faster menu navigation and focus point selection along with an extra customizable button to give photographers more control without diving into menus. The rear LCD is set for a noticeable upgrade, both in resolution and functionality. Not only will it deliver sharper, more accurate previews of those 100 megapixel captures, but it will also feature a tilting mechanism that now angles downward, expanding usability for overhead and high angle shots. A top-mounted LCD will provide at-a-glance shooting parameters, reinforcing Hasselblad's commitment to streamlined ergonomics. As with its predecessor, the camera will accept a wide range of lenses, from the native XCD series to adapted HC, HCD, XPAN, and V-System glass, making it appealing to those already invested in Hasselblad's ecosystem. The body will continue to exude the timeless industrial design language that has long been part of the brand's identity, but these ergonomic enhancements hint that the X2D2 will be as functional in the field as it is beautiful on the shelf. Performance has been the Achilles heel of previous Hasselblad medium format bodies, but the X2D2 may be the company's most determined attempt to close that gap. At its core will be a 100 megapixel medium format CMOS sensor measuring 43.8 by 32.9 millimeters, offering 16-bit color depth and a dynamic range expected to reach approximately 15 stops. This should deliver extraordinary tonal precision and highlight retention, especially in high contrast environments. The headline upgrade is the integration of DJI's LiDAR autofocus system, Technology derived from DJI's Ronin 4D Cinema platform. This leap in focusing capability could mean a drastic reduction in acquisition time and improved tracking of moving subjects. Face detection will be native, and while Hasselblad has yet to confirm continuous AF, the LiDAR system strongly suggests that real-time subject tracking will finally make its way into the X system. In-body image stabilization will remain a key feature with a five-axis system offering up to eight stops of compensation. This should make handheld shooting at slower shutter speeds more feasible, especially when working with such a high-resolution sensor. Paired with the brand's Hasselblad Natural Color Solution, photographers can expect files with lifelike tones and subtle gradations straight out of the camera. Although Hasselblad has not confirmed any video functionality, the hardware tells an interesting story. The combination of LiDAR AF, high-speed CF express storage, and a robust IBIS system suggests the X2D2 could be physically capable of handling high bitrate video formats, perhaps leaving the door open for a firmware-enabled video mode in the future. If so, it would be the most significant shift in Hasselblad's digital strategy in years. X 2D2 will keep many of the hallmarks that made the 100C version stand out while introducing critical upgrades aimed at modern workflows. Storage will be one of its defining advantages. A built-in 1TB SSD will allow photographers to shoot extensively without swapping cards, while the CFX Press Type-B slot will handle fast write speeds for demanding burst sequences 
or potential high-resolution video. The LiDAR autofocus system will be the centerpiece of the feature set, promising speed and precision that rivals the fastest mirrorless systems. For studio photographers, this means precise focusing in low-light setups. For outdoor shooters, it could be the difference between nailing a fleeting moment and missing it entirely. The camera's compatibility with multiple lens systems adds enormous creative flexibility. From ultra-wide perspectives to telephoto compression, photographers will have access to a vast optical library that spans decades of Hasselblad's history. Combined with the sensor's resolution, this opens possibilities for large-scale prints, intricate commercial work, and fine art photography. Color science remains one of Hasselblad's strongest selling points. HNCS will once again ensure that skin tones, landscapes, and product shots maintain an organic, natural look, reducing the need for heavy post-processing. This is part of what keeps Hasselblad attractive to professionals who want predictable, consistent output straight from the RAW file and expanded storage. For comparison, Fujifilm's GFX 102 offers similar resolution and hybrid functionality at a lower cost, but Hasselblad is banking on its build quality, color science, and unique design philosophy to justify the premium. It's worth noting that despite the X2D 100C's lack of video, it has remained one of the top-selling medium format cameras at major retailers. The X2D2, with its upgraded performance and potential hybrid-ready hardware, could draw in not only existing Hasselblad users but also professionals looking for a medium format body that doesn't compromise on operational speed. The Hasselblad X2D2 will arrive at a critical moment for the medium format segment. Competition is more aggressive than ever, with Fujifilm, Leica, and even compact newcomers pushing the boundaries of what large sensors can deliver. If Hasselblad's leaks hold true, the X2D2 will represent a calculated step forward, a camera that preserves the company's devotion to still photography while equipping it with the tools to remain relevant in an increasingly hybrid world. The decision to integrate DJI's LiDAR autofocus could prove transformative, addressing one of the most consistent critiques of medium format systems, sluggish AF performance. Combined with the high-resolution tilting LCD, expanded controls, generous internal storage, and IBIS stabilization, this camera appears to be engineered for both precision and practicality. The lingering question is whether Hasselblad will take the final step and enable video recording. The hardware is capable and the market is ready, but the company's philosophical stance on keeping its medium format cameras still only has been unwavering, until now. If the Hasselblad X2D2 launches without video, it will likely still find strong adoption among professional still photographers. If it embraces hybrid shooting, however, it could redefine Hasselblad's place in the industry for years to come. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching.